Yes, each team now has three players left for tonight's sudden death decider, Tin Can Alley. Each team has three balls and one pyramid of tin cans. The team who manages to knock the most cans over with their three balls wins the series. Simple. I'll now hand you over to our official and versus deck commentator, David Goldstrom. Thanks, Kirsty. Well, everything absolutely on a night edge. It's Ant's team to go first. And remember, each team has three balls to uh, on, knock down on, those 15 cans, and they have to go completely off the shelf. So Johnny Wilkin works to open for Ant's team. Look at that. Yeah. Five cans left. That's ten away. Great start for Ants. Good luck, mate. Here comes Bobby Dabro. The next team. Already under pressure. Oh, what a complete miss. Advantage Ant. Next man up. Brian Conway. Only five cans to remove. A split. Four and one. He's got to go for the four. So a chance for Anthony Costa to bring Dex team back into the competition. And that's a pretty good one, but look at that. That is seven left. Come on, Ant. So it's five Come versus seven. Come on, Ant. Oh. So now it's down to Deck. Deck needs to get rid of three cans to win this. Absolutely on the edge. Real pressure. Two cans won't do. Three will. And he's taken two off. And that is five apiece. So that is going to mean an extra ball, I think, per team. Sudden death, I think. So, team captains go again. And first. Oh, Deck. All he needs is one single can. And he's done it! The tech has come from the line to take the team challenge at versus Deck. And for a fifth time, Deck is triumphant. Such hard luck on Ant. Commiseration to Team Ant. He was that close. A couple of cans, that's what it came down to. Yeah. Kirsty. Congratulations, Team Deck. What, what a decider, I just can't believe it. You get the cup uh, and well done. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you.